Tell us he's a good day. Okay, bud. Good morning, it's uh, Wednesday the 6th of July 22, we're in uh, just outside Danoon on the second day, or well, they'd be day one on the bikes, second day of the first tour of Argyle and Butte uh, for 2022. Uh, uh, Travelled up yesterday. Uh, the bike's in Paul's van, long journey to 370 miles, about nine hours with stops and traffic jams and delays. And uh, this is our first proper day of riding and as you can see the weather is absolutely crap. But uh, it's not going to uh, dampen our spirits, we're going uh, to plod on regardless. So today we're, uh, we're doing a probably a 220 mile uh, round trip around the locks and the mountains and the roads of uh, Argyle and Butte. I think we're going up towards, uh, uh, oh, I forgot the name of the place, uh, Gitanon, going up around there. So uh, I'll tell you more about what we're doing as we get further into it. At the moment, I say the Royal Enfield's having its first trip out. Wet roads, still quite virgin tyres. Uh, and me still getting used to some degree to the bike so bear with on this one we're not going to see any uh, any gymnastics or anything with what we're doing today we've got the chain up so we'll probably have a conversation going as the day goes by and uh, say so just uh, stick around and see where things take us and how things develop uh, yeah I'm probably going to come back a little bit later when we're uh, maybe there's been a change in the weather Tomorrow and Friday the weather's looking better but today it's, uh, it's pretty grim today but uh, it's just uh, far for the course with what we do well, There we go okay, Yeah, all good mate All good All good So yeah, so uh, as I say stick around and we'll see where the day takes us yeah so we're about 23 miles from the dig now and uh, change dropped out as expected uh, I was just hopefully ending into something uh, quite spectacular apart from the mist and, uh, yeah, temperature wise it's cool but not uncomfortable so we're all right so recap on yesterday's journey set off from um, our uh, place down in the Midlands about quarter to seven a couple of traffic jams on the motorway for accidents on the M6 coming north uh, we stopped off for breakfast at tea bay services around about 10 30 uh, had a lovely breakfast at the farm shop there um, tea bay then back on the road up the rest of the M6, M74, round the bottom of Glasgow, over the Erskine Bridge, and up uh, and along past Loch Lomond. We were at Loch Lomond around about two o'clock. Had about like half an hour at Loch Lomond, had an ice cream and uh, took in the sights. Absolutely beautiful up there. Um, really stunning, clear day, sunny day, and just beautiful blue Loch Lomond. That was that was awesome, and then back on the road, uh, we uh, uh, arrived at the digs at uh, Clyde View Bed and Breakfast uh, at around about 3:30. Um, it's absolutely lovely place, really really nice. Um, 
lovely couple that are running it from Har um, I think it's Harrogate. No, not Harrogate, definitely Chesterfield. Chesterfield. Really nice, absolutely immaculate uh, uh, room, lovely accommodation, uh, and a delicious breakfast this morning. Uh, Scottish breakfast. Uh, no pubs open or anything to eat a meal last night, so we had to go on a two and a half mile hike to a like a holiday camp or a holiday home park called uh, Hunter's Key. Um, and we had a meal there, which was really nice. Uh, that was lovely. So, uh, uh, and then a two and a half mile walk back from there. So we got a lot of exercise in yesterday evening. And uh, that's prepared us for today's uh, excursion. And we were, Paul and I were pretty tired yesterday when we got here. Um, pretty, uh, although you know, Paul was driving a little early and it was, you know, it had uh, worn us out a little bit. So that was uh, the journey up here yesterday. And we've got three days to explore the uh, Igor the Beauty before we head back on Saturday. Uh, oh yeah, there's a nice couple from uh, Weatherby, uh, I think it's man and wife or a man and his partner, a couple, uh, they're on a, a bit of a tour up here, very nice couple, uh, it's really good chat with them this morning and uh, shared experiences and that was, uh, that was really nice. So that's uh, that's the, th the, the scores on the doors so far. All oh, these roads are looking good. So as I say, hopefully I can catch some of the uh, experience with you today, although it's wet, of, uh, of what we're enjoying. And the Royal Enfield, yeah. So far, so good. Wow, look at that. That is. is that that's not lock heck, is it? I don't know. It did come to lock from the other side. Oh, I don't know, Dave. But let's we'll have, have a look on the maps later. Hello. I'm back, I'm back Hello? again. Back again. That's okay. Sometimes it half drops out. Sometimes it completely drops out. Yeah, I know, I just don't know. When you talk to it, I think you get an awful lot of uh, noise disturbance. Yeah. Because you just keep getting this reverberation and noises. And I'll switch it off, put it back on, and you don't get it there. So just once you cut there, the channel's open. And it's searching, it's like searching for some of the things. Yeah, yeah. I call it, if you turn it off, then back on there, there's now other noise that I'm talking. It's just normally because I get a load of noise. Yeah. Oh, I think if you get that to show us, it's here, you press the red button and reinstall it, comes back on. Yeah. This is a reception of this one. Yeah, yeah. So, we'll see. A nice sweeper, isn't he? Yeah, it is actually a present. Oh, no loud marking. Uh, okay.
That's really cool with a bird on it, don't tell you where you're meant to or what you're doing. Uh, oh, uh, we've got a sign, we've got a sign in Bear Island. There you am. And you am. In Bear Island, or whatever that is. In Bear Island. It's a funny light. Oh, it's a bridge, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Are you know, are you giving comments through the day's events? Yeah. Yeah, it's funny, you might need to get a break with our card. Yeah, funny, isn't it? Yeah. I thought I'd better keep quiet because you'll be hearing me interrupting. No, I couldn't either. I thought you'd disconnected, that's why I did it. I don't know what I did. No, really, you said about the first day, the blow being from uh, Chesterfield, and you said about them from... Uh, there you go. That's what I am. Not white, yeah, so, yeah. There you go. Like a bit like a Channel 4 scratch to the program. Yeah, keep them. Uh, yeah, I'm getting the light. I'm getting the light. Come and see, see. Three in the bed. Three right in the bed. Yeah, we're going to turn in there. Sorry, I'm going to. 140 yards, you've got to go up this road here, okay? okay. So the Whoop. Inverary is. There's here, alright? Oh, I thought we could have done it there now. <laughs> I know, through the archway. <sighs> Strange, isn't it? I know. Here we go. Alright, that's it. Yeah, you can't beat me on the lollipop signs. Day right. Good thing, right. Yeah, good morning. So, we've got 8.8 miles till we turn left Okay. Right, we're going to turn left here. Okay. Pass on top of the hill there to the right, that one we should see the other day, yesterday. You'll see, when you see it, it's on the right hand side, that castle we can see yesterday. Yeah, yeah, no, no, Or totally right. to whatever it is. Yeah. I think it was only your seat now, because, um, I think I know, it's probably the star over there, over to the right. Yeah. Right, we're going to turn left. Yeah, very much like New Galloway. Yep, trees, up and down, yep. Well, that's where sometimes in certain aspects of this, it's like uh, it's different, but it ain't that much different, is it? No. You know what I mean? No. And New Galloway is closer, uh, so it's a different series of interest. So you get what, what's this sort of glorified difference between this and the so, you know, the whole room, really. It's the locks, isn't it? You've got loads of locks here where you haven't got yeah. that down there. Now, you've only got the odd ones there, so there's more locks, and also where we're supposed to be going, get close to the sea as well. Yeah. But then you've still got the sea in the southern part, that was lovely, and so I was going around the bottom of the uh, past wall of Woodford and around there, and you've got some four tides Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. You know, so. Six of them are returning, Dave. Okay, mate. Dave? Yep, okay. Point six, yep. See the view in front now, I think. Yeah, I see it. Think. See it. Oh. See the water, I see it, whatever it is, a lot. Oh, it's gone now, you can see it earlier. Yeah. Point three, we'll see this side here, we're telling us to turn. Yep, gonna turn somewhere in a minute. Here, oh, there. Presume. I'm gonna turn here, mate. Okay. Right. Yeah, there's that bridge over there, you know. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> okay. I know. Uh, I thought it was a truck, I thought it was a truck. Okay, here we go. It's a one-way street, by the way, okay. I think. 
looks like it. That was, I saw it. Was Super Dad I hope so. Yeah, there's a side that says one way straight. <laughs> yep. Better side from side, Myers. Yep. So this is 4.1 of a mile now, then we'll turn left again. Okay. Gravel in the middle. So we're going to turn left. Hello. Now. So this must be the road that is going to the, with the lock on your right, I think. Okay. Because you've got 20 miles of this, Dave. Okay. Yeah, the roads are good, Nick, yeah. Yeah. They're just nice yeah. to see them. That's <laughs> 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 That's the trouble I've got to go over and see them. I mean, I'd like to be right alive, but, um, yeah. Do you want me to pull over here a bit and put some nah. spray on the visor or something? Nah, I'm all right. The trouble is, you're trying to open the visor. It gets me on my glasses. Then I can't see at all, oh, then. Of course. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. So, uh, yeah, I'm balanced. I have to keep my visor down to keep my glasses clear. <laughs> Can you keep it up a, keep it up a fraction? I'm just trying to keep it... Uh... I'm trying to, yeah. Oh, right. yeah, it is what it is. You just say it's mate. That's why you, well, you can't get out quicker than we get in anyway. No, no. It's a bit dangerous, so it's, it's all right.
interesting. Interesting bit of road. Oh, I'm soaking wet and utterly miserable. This weather has been just, I don't know what, just so damp and horrible. Can't see out my visor properly. Well, we don't know why today, but although the rain's not absolutely booking it down, we seem to have become totally waterlogged. Everything's waterlogged. And uh, it's put a real damper on today, to be honest. I can't see where I'm going very well. And, uh, yeah. So. Turned out to be a bit of a damp squib today, unfortunately. Senna seems to have malfunctioned, probably uh, water. Uh, yeah, not good. Hopefully we can get it resolved and uh, get things working again for tomorrow. For the moment, uh, yeah, it's uh, not working at all. Probably be alright. Well, I've done 104 miles so far. Done 104 miles so far. 